Hi everybody, it is the 13th of July 2021. Daisy Update 1.13 has dropped for uh, Xbox, PlayStation and PC. So in this video, I'm going to show you how you can update your console private uh, servers for PlayStation and Xbox to the new 1.13 files for Nitrado. So what will have happened today is that the back end of your server has already been updated so the daisy server.exe file if you like the bit that runs daisy the bit that's giving you you know the new zombies you know and the, and the new um the new wound infection mechanic that's all there that's all working now but what you haven't got yet are the new xml files so the xml files you probably know but if you're not quite sure they're that they're the bits that control the economy of your server so they're the bits importantly that are going to be giving your players the new m16 uh, the new atog is it a six time scope um and uh what else is there there's the new machete isn't there and there's a few other new things as well if you don't update your xml's people will still have the 1.13 XMLs or whatever you've got on there, your custom XMLs right now. And using this technique, what we're going to be doing is we're going to be turning your XML files to the 1.13 vanilla files. They're going to be the new files. They're going to have the new loop balancing. They're going to have the, the new, new items in, all, all that sort of stuff. This is not a wipe. We're not wiping players' progress. Your players are still going to be there with all the stuff they've got. The bases are still going to be there. You may lose some vehicles that are associated with events that don't happen anymore if you've got custom events. But everything else is going to be fine. This is not a wipe. However, what this will do is this is going to turn all your custom XMLs, if you're using them right now, to vanilla ones so this is the time to download them and back them up if you haven't got a copy somewhere because they will be disappearing after we do this so here we go so we're in my um, my dashboard so let's look at this um playstation server 1c scale speeder gaming playstation 4 and show you how you do it so you click on the little gears icon and this will take us to the control panel for that particular nitrido server and then we want to go into the <coughs> excuse me the general settings so click on general and you scroll down, scroll down, scroll down. And what you're looking for is this one here, Reset Mission XML to Default. And you want to tick that, and you want to save that. Now, just to say it one more time, so we are not wiping the server. We are not getting rid of anybody's progress. However, what we are do, doing is changing all those types that XMLs, those events that XMLs, those CFG spawnable types that XMLs, those map group protos XMLs. They're all going back to vanilla. So all that custom modding you've done will be disappearing and your server will be going to vanilla. You're going to have to look at the um, the 113 files and then merge in your mod you do. Or maybe you'll do it the other way around. You'll take your modded files and merge in the changes from, from 113, whichever way you want to do it. But by doing this, you'll be giving your players on your server the new loot balancing and the new items. So once we've done that, once we've ticked that and we've saved it, you just click restart. Now I've already done it, so I don't need to do it again. Um, and you need to do that with all your servers. Now, if you want to check whether it's worked or not, um, go into your file browser, like so. Go into Daisy PS Missions. And then, if it's a Chernerus folder, you're looking for Chernerus. If it's a Liver, sorry, if it's a Chernerus server, go into the Chernerus uh, folder. If it's a if it's a Livonia server, go into the Enoch folder. You go into here, and we go. I mean, there's a couple of things you can look at. The easiest one to look at, I think, is uh, CFG spawnable types because it's not that big. So you click on that, and that will then pop up. And then just click somewhere in the text box, type Control F on your computer, and look for, you see that at the box, look for M16. Press Enter, there you go, because the M16 is the new item. So there it is, so the M16 uh, A2, we know this server has been updated, and we can tell everybody on our Discords or on our Facebook group, or whatever you've got, that the server has been updated, the XMLs have been updated, keep a good lookout for those bloody hard-to-kill zombies now. <laughs> Uh, and the new M16, the new mag for the M16 and the M4, the new mag for the AKs, the new scope, the new machete, um, and there's a new thing for disinfecting your wounds, isn't there, and disinfecting bandages. So there we go. That, my friends, is how you update your Nitrado console, PlayStation or Xbox server, to update 1.13, to update the XMLs. Hopefully you found that useful. If you have, hit the like button. If you want to see me on the same, press subscribe, and I will, of course, see you again soon.